We are gathered here today to sip some tea, honey. So make sure you guys have your teacups ready because this tea is what? Piping hot. Hey you guys, I hope you guys are doing good. So for all your tea sipping needs, don't forget to go on to lovelytea.net or amazon.com forward slash shop forward slash lovely tea. Thank you guys so much for the support and stay tuned for the video. All right, you guys. So it seems to be trouble in paradise for Regine Wina Flucci. And it seems like at this point in time, love don't live here anymore. Okay. So it looks like they've officially broken up for the 120th time. Okay. So what is going down is this. So the other day, Regine started subtweeting and retweeting a bunch of people who were saying a lot of deep shit. Okay. So at that point, we all felt that there was something amiss. So Regine took to social media um, she is basically retweeting somebody and this person writes the hardest pill to swallow is realizing people don't care. They really don't. They'll hurt you and really go on about their lives, not even slightly affected by what they did to you and how you feel. Crazy part is you can't do shit about it, but move on. So Regine retweets that person and she writes felt this one. So then after that, she proceeds to then post and delete this. She says, whoever played with my heart, you a dumb MF. So after she posted, then she deleted that. And then she posted again and said, I don't think you niggas ever gonna grow up to be honest. So since then, both messages have since disappeared. Along with all of her pictures with YNF Lucci, she deleted everything. Delete all that shit. Delete all that shit. Best play with you, piggy. Lucci left up one picture of the two of them on his page, but today he's now responding about their breakup, okay? So this is what went down today. So Regine wrote, I hate a friendly ass nigga. Then she proceeded to write, let him go, keep yourself. So then after that, basically Lucci confirmed the breakup by stating this. He writes, love is just a word, it don't matter to me. Hashtag free 21. And then he put a picture up with his face looking downward and him trying to look sad. And, of course, some of his fans were saying, you know what, why does he have to be the bad guy? Maybe Regine did something to him. You know, she's not innocent in this. So there was a lot of back and forth on his Instagram page. And then Regine comes and she says, Alexis, play How to Love by Lil Wayne. Thanks. So this entire situation, honey, is a hot damn mess. But I can't say that I'm shocked. I never thought that they were a good fit, okay? I've been reporting on them ever since they got together. He's way older than her. He has all types of kids, you know, different baby mamas. He's in a whole different world. If she expected a grown man with money who's in the industry, who has access to all types of women, Regine's young self had another thing coming, unfortunately. You know, she just needs to count her blessings, you know what I'm saying? Take it as a lesson learned. We've all been there. You know, we've all dated people that we probably shouldn't have dated. But, you know, that's part of being, you know, a young person. You're supposed to date and see your options you're supposed to see things for yourself no matter what her mother told her no matter what her daddy probably told her no call your daddy no matter what the hell i done damn told her on youtube she ain't trying to listen to us she has to make her own mistakes she has to live her own life she has to see things for herself and after all she's a grown woman now she's 20 years old so regine will be okay you know she needs to count her blessings that she got you know she got some good peen you know what i'm saying she went on a few trips she took some cute pictures they had a good old funky time while they were together but thank goodness most of all she did not get pregnant okay Okay, because he was showing up trying to knock up Lil Wayne's daughter. And I believe he's trying to knock her up just for the fact that she was Lil Wayne's daughter. Okay, thank goodness the birth control worked and she did not end up knocked up by YNF Lucci and that she's not his fourth baby mama. So now she can just pick up, move on and find somebody better for her. I'm not saying that the person better for her is around Regine's age. I really didn't too much care about the age difference. My issue was the fact that he had so many kids and so many different babies' mothers. You know what I'm saying? That was always my issue with this situation because like I said, at the end of the day, she's a grown woman but I wish her the best I hope she finds true love I hope she finds somebody who can be faithful to her and be with her and just her and in the meantime I also wish you know YNF Lucci the best as well you know things happen this is like your hundredth relationship hopefully you will eventually find the one but in the meantime he makes good music and I'm still gonna listen to his music I don't give a shit yeah every day we lit yeah you can't tell me shit yeah remember I was broke yeah now I'm getting rich Anyway, y'all, let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. Go ahead and leave a comment. Let me know your thoughts on this entire crazy situation with Regine and Wine Flucci. I think they've really broken up this time because this time he's confirming it. The last time, you know, he was trying to, you know, whisper sweet nothings in her ear and bring her back, and he did. But I think this time he's tired and she's damn sure tired. So I think it's officially over. But if they do decide to get back together in the future, it is what it is, honey. Either way, I'm going to be here for it, bitch, okay? Let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. Go ahead and leave a comment. All right, deuces. 
Hey you guys, it's your girl T and I hope you really enjoyed that video. If you want to know more about my look of the day or if you want a way to contact me concerning advertisement and sponsorship deals, definitely feel free to click my description box. There's plenty of information in there. Please stay tuned for the next video. Talk to y'all later.